everyone welcome back another day out here it's trash picking day once again just got back from a flea market not too long ago found one thing on the way back so i'll include that clip first uh seems like my neighbor's also mowing the yard i've mowed my yard twice now but looks like it needs to be mowed again but no time for that it's trash picking no days off 2021 let's get out there see what's in the trash today and make another fun adventure and hopefully find some treasure let's do it all right looks like a double whammy possibly the double whammy oh almost missed all that so morning pick first clip coming back from the flea market grab this Really nice rocking chair. Nice, perfect size. Five, ten bucks, just like that. Oh, geez, it's broken up here. No, I can glue that together. I know I did it a long time ago. Actually, I did that with a rocking chair. I had to glue it back. Still sold it. what I thought it was. How's it going? Best score in the wall. All right, might have to swing back here later. Guy literally just walked back after putting something out. That's where I found all that lead.
first one I've ever found one of these. And I know these things are not light. So we're going to evaluate and see how heavy it really is. Also, if there's a propane tank in here, that is not coming home with me. Can it? Whoa. All right, we'll put this in first and we'll figure out how you open this. I don't know if there's a way. There's got to be a way to open that. You don't. Oh, somebody's mowing their yard over here. You don't want to move that when there's a propane tank in there. You're first some deep trouble. You don't know this it's a heater. These things are really whoa, really, really pricey. This thing ain't that heavy. Hopefully the guy comes out and lets me know if it's I see him more. If he lets me know it's good, I'm gonna try selling this. This is insanely expensive. Alright. We're good. Gotta say it does feel amazing out here. 55 degrees, 60 degrees. It's nice and housewares. Mm, somebody definitely ransacked these. Really? Open, they are open. Take these bunch of shoes, bags. Who knows if somebody's gonna buy it? Um, I saw someone parked right there closing their door, and then I drove by and I was like, oh, maybe they're looking at that pile, so must have went through that stuff. Funny how we find the same casualties every week. This guy who was here, he must have sold the house. It was in rough shape when I first started doing trash picking. They used to put out a ton of stuff. That was back in the early days. Oh man, heavy microwave. Man, they used to throw away some good stuff. I remember those days. Back when I drove the van, which I didn't know if it actually... Didn't know if it would start that day. Didn't know if the brakes would work. Didn't I'd just be stranded somewhere. Ah. Sky doesn't even look real. At least not to me it doesn't. Looks like it was painted on there. Still don't know what in the metal day is for this town, but that's where I just found that microwave. In this situation, they literally will not take that. Like, crazy to me. That trash company would just like drive by it, but hey, different way of doing business, different way of collecting trash. Really, really, really happy about that, uh, that dresser. That is absolutely perfect. Uh, the only thing different I would probably want, if it was anything, would be that it would be a tall boy rather than one of those short ones. Uh, the tall, narrow ones sell very, very well. Uh, but that's still, you know, antique shop, $75, $85 for that thing. And that's a good deal at $85. Uh, so, always good to have that. I do have a buyer who buys all my furniture, all my real wood furniture, that is guys been around for the channel you guys know exactly the deal with that um, and it's nice because I know that stuff's not getting thrown out into the garbage and it's or at least it's not going to the landfill and someone else will definitely enjoy it someone else out there who might not even have access to that kind of furniture is going to uh, is going to enjoy it so very very cool I don't think we're seeing too much here in town too off to town three been a while since I stopped here. I've been 
picking up metal here for four or five years. I guess I'll just place that now. Must be rotor season. Find these a bunch now. Finding these a bunch. Right there, it's not gonna break anything. Might even hot it, stop it from rolling over a little. Kind of a cool shelf. They took out the motor. They took out the little globe things. I call them globes. We just left the fan. Did they? Maybe the motor's on the other side? Nope. Motor's gone. That's a piece of uh, insulation with like a metal thing around it. What do we have out? Here. Is that Ryobi? Ryobi lawnmower. Lawnmower. Weed whacker. More interested in the other stuff. That is. Is that what is what would you even call that? That's not a milk crate. Maybe for files, folders. Got some hosing. Anything in there doesn't look like it. Looks like all we're grabbing is the uh, the weed whacker. Ooh, a four cycle. I think that's what that means you don't need to do the uh, the old oil gas wow something melted right there the old oil and gas trick feels like there's gas in there I actually watched the uh, the garbage truck guy garbage man he opened up the uh, the fuel tank the gas tank saw there was gas in there and just like chucked in the yard I guess they won't take it if there's gas in there. Makes sense. Let's see what the uh, capacitor house has. Let's see a plate. Ugh. Made in China. Not for me. It was almost good stuff. It was almost Fiesta wear, but it's not. It's a knockoff Walmart brand. Hey, look, a mattress. Two mattresses. All right, I guess I'm going to take advantage of kind of the warmer weather. I don't know if it's going to rain or what. I didn't realize how much this uh, this tree over here started to bloom. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. At some point, I want to take down that little chunk of walnut trees, but um, fortunately, I don't think I'm going to get around to doing that this spring. I wanted to get before all the walnuts and everything for them, but that's not going to happen. But what did happen is we found some treasure. So, yes, another awesome day of treasure hunting yes another awesome day so yeah uh, i guess i grabbed this thing <laughs> for a second i was like did i break that uh that frame it's a new frame as well it's not old it's made to look old but i did not break it uh kind of a cool little silver plate thing here also not sure if this is magnetic it kind of looks like it's older it's not going to be magnetic it's not I'd like to say this is probably brass underneath. I don't think this is uh, sterling by any means. Man, if that thing was sterling. Woo! We'd have some some partying going on. Uh, but yeah, my favorite find most definitely is this awesome dresser. So someone did paint this. Um, I said how much I like the larger ones, the ones that are tall. This one's a good size for myself to move around. When you start talking the big ones, the wide ones are like from here all the way to the front of this. That's when you start ending up into like trouble of trying to find the right buyer, uh, transporting, storage, everything. Uh, these small ones really do sell amazing. 
if you're trying to get into the furniture business and you see these things out in the trash, you can almost always assure yourself that someone on Facebook Marketplace in your town or city is going to want one of these. It's even got the old backing. Uh, once in a while, you will find furniture that just has like a little piece of what looks like, I don't even say, um, I don't know what you even call it. It's not cardboard, it's not sheet rock, it's not plywood. But some of the old furniture has a really thin piece, but all the new stuff does have that thin piece. You kind of have to tell based off the, the actual material itself if it's old, but if it ever has this, it's a good quality made piece of furniture. So, yeah, that's that. Um, other than that, one other fun day out there treasure hunting. Hopefully you guys enjoyed yet another fun adventure. Always a blast to go out there. Many more trash picking videos will be posted in the future. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. If you want, share the channel. Tell your friends about Taco Stacks. Let's help grow the Taco Stacks community. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Until next time, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace.